Hey, hello, hello, guys. Hello, girls. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Uh, hello, JC. How are you? How are you today? I'm fine. All right. Um, That's great. Yes. Okay. Hello, Carmen. Carmen, I see you. I see you there. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hey, hi. Good evening. How's it going today, Carmen? Good? Excuse me, teacher. How is it going? How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Thank you. I'm working. Okay, that's that's cool. Let's see. Erica, hello, Erica. How is it going to you? Good? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hey, hello. Good evening. Uh, thank you for joining to the class. It's uh, already eight o'clock. We are going to begin uh, with uh, class number nine. We are advancing. This is uh, week number three. Did you finish, uh, girls? Did you finish the, the midterm exam last week? Could you complete it? Could you finish uh, the yes, midterm? Teacher. Yes. Issues, problems? No. Yes. Which ones, Carmen? Um, eran dos laboratorios con los que tuve y los reporté, pero me dijeron que avanzara con los demás y avancé con oh. los otros, pero no he podido completar los demás. Ah, uh, oh, okay. You requested the help and they told you to continue with with the rest. Ah, uh, okay, okay. We are gonna check on that because uh. You may be, you need more points to complete, right? For those exercises. Okay, but we are going to be pressing. Vamos a estar ahí presionando, right? So they can fix the issues with the platform. Okay, girls, uh, welcome. Thank you for joining class number. Let me let me share the, uh, the computer, the monitor. Class number nine. This is week number three. Um, we finish the course, uh, let me see, the next Thursday, 19. That is the final day. All right. We have four classes this week and the other four the next week. And we finish on the 19th. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to open the class. I'm going to advance directly to the lesson you know. That if you have a camera, use it. Use your camera. Please turn it on so we can interact, all right? Because if not, I feel that I am interacting with a computer, all right? And I need to see you. All right, perfect. Let's see. Class number nine, uh, printer immediate model two. All right. The class is going to be about this, this topic. That is describing people. Describing people. All right. Uh, you know how to describe people? You know this actress? You know her? Who's she? Let me see if you know about movies, about series. Who's she, you know? Do you recognize this actress? No, teacher. No? Yes, this is uh, the per no, I don't know how, how do you say protagonista? Uh, actress. Actress. I'm or the actress the, of, of the movie. The of the Barbie movie. Ah, okay. Yeah, you get one point with your with your answer. She act, acted. Well, she acted in Barbie movie. She acted. You can use the verb. Puedo usar el verbo act, actuar. Ajá, Erika, she acted. In which movie? Uh, Barbie, you said, right? No, teacher. I don't see. Uh, yo. Ah, uh, yes, uh, yes. Ah, okay, yes. yes. Ah, okay, she acted in? She acted. Ajá, a Barbie, uh, Barbie movie. In the Barbie movie. Um, 
Okay. In the Barbie uh, movie and the other movie is um Harley Quinn is the is the Ah, okay, you're right. Uh-huh. In the Harley Quinn in which movie? What is the movie in The movie is, is ba Batman? I don't know. I don't remember. Uh, no. Hi, no, no. Hi the teacher. Movie... Hey, hello, hello guys. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, the movie is uh, uh, Lobo de Wall Street. Ah, with uh, with this actor. actor. Wife. Uh -huh. uh, the wife. Uh, 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 Leonardo DiCaprio. Ah, all right. Okay, yeah. She acted with in with the Leonardo in that movie. Correct. A Harley Quinn and the movie in, in she appeared as a Harley Quinn. Which is a movie, you know? Uh, La Liga, or I don't remember the, the movie exactly, the name. Yeah, but you're right. And what is her name? What's her name? You know? Three Seal Squark, I would say. Okay. Uh, no. Ah, the movie, see, the movie is Three Seal Squark. Ah, the suicide. Let's repeat the suicide. Suicide, suicide. squad. Huh? Square. Suicide. Correct. Yeah, the suicide is square. Yes. And what is <laughs> her name? You know the, the actress, the actress name? By the way. No. No. Okay, find it. Find it on the internet quickly. Harley Quinn uh, actress movie. Her you can find is, it. Her name is uh, Margot Robin. She is correct. She is a Margot Robbie. Correct. Very good. Okay, check the picture. What could you say about Margot Robbie? The question is, how, how would you? How would you describe? Describe, describe, describe how her. Would you describe her. Margot Robbie. <clears throat> Look at the picture as a reference. What can you tell me about Margot Robbie, about her appearance? Can you describe her in your own words? What can you tell me about Margot Robbie's appearance in this picture? She, she has uh, blonde hair. Ah, all right. Okay, very good. Just a small correction. We say she has because he's a third person. Okay. She has a blonde hair. She has blonde, blonde hair. You don't need the article. No necesita el article. Um, no article. Okay. She has blonde hair. Correct. She has blonde hair. Um, what else? What else? What else? She has a beautiful woman. <laughs> uh, I, in that case, you need to use the verb to be. She is. Repeat it, Guillermo. She is a beautiful woman. Ah, in that way, yes. In that, in that way is correct. What else? She is a beautiful woman. She has blonde hair. Correct. What else? Only two things about Margot Robbie. She okay. has wearing a black dress. All right. She is wearing a black dress. Uh -huh. That is a way to describe using uh, or referring to the clothes that the person is using, correct. But in the appearance, I mean the body, the body appearance. Huh? Col eyes color. White test. She, she has, uh, she has. Uh, she has. Uh, she has uh, green eyes. Green. Um, I believe. Uh, gray, maybe gray. <laughs> I see them gray. gray. Yeah, gray. correct. She has gray eyes. Correct. Ah, uh, about the the test. Uh, the skin you you meant right? About the skin. Yes. Yes or no? What color is skin? Is she? What color? Black. White. Ah, okay. But we say subject very complement. Remember, she has. Hmm? He has 
white skin. White skin, correct. She has white skin. Okay. Teacher, yeah. She has a nice smile. Ah, she nice. She has a she nice. Has a nice smile. Correct. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Because in the picture she is smiling. She's happy. All right. Very good. Okay. Nice. All right, guys. Sometimes in conversations in English we need or we have to describe people's appearance. Let's check. Uh, what can you say about she? Examples. Mm -hmm. She's young. She's young, correct. Next. She's, she's tall. Ah, uh, do you consider that she's tall? Yes. yes. Yeah, yes. she is, right? Uh huh. Yes. What else? She has a strong, she has strong long, long hair. hair. All right, she has a strong. What is a stride? Uh, talking about the hair, people's hair. What is a stride? Hmm? <laughs> a stride. What is a stride? Liso. Ah, uh, correct. Yes, Liso. Okay, stride. very good. Yeah, that is a stride. Blonde hair. We are going to be talking about hair, all right? About face, etc. Okay. And what else? What else can you mention about Margot Robbie in this picture? She is beautiful. She's ah, beautiful. that's right. Yes, I agree. I agree with that. <laughs> okay, next. She she's is intelligent. intelligent. Ah, okay, she's intelligent. And she finally. She's lovely. She's lovely. She's lovely. Okay, very good. Okay, let's see. Let's continue with the next part. Uh, in this opportunity, uh, please, uh, Gilbert, uh, can you participate, Gilbert? What do you need to describe uh, people's uh, appearance? What What do we need to describe? Mm. Gilbert, yes, can you can you oh, talk? Teacher. Okay, please. Sorry. When when describing someone's appearance, we describe. All right, someone's appearance. What is the appearance? Appearance. appearance. What is the appearance? Appearance. As you look. Appearance. All right. As you look. We right. describe. That's it. Okay. Okay. What do what do we describe? We describe hey, it. Uh -huh. hey, we have eye hey. color. Hmm? Skin color. Height. Height. Uh, length. Uh, okay, in this word is a height. What is a height? height. Uh, you know uh, LeBron yeah. James. You know LeBron James uh, from the from the basketball the basketball team. LeBron, no, uh, no. His height is is he's tall, so his height is two meters and ten oh. centimeters. Oh. Uh, and height. Okay. Height. What is height? height. Alto. Uh, no, Alto. that is tall. That is altura. the altitude. Tall. Altura. Ah, very good. Tall. Height is altura. Tall and or small? Is tall? What is tall, tall. guys? Tall. Is... Tall. Hmm? Alto. Alto, correct. Okay. Tall is an adjective and height is a noun. When describing people, we use nouns and we use adjectives. We are gonna check on that. Uh, what else? What else do we describe? Hair. Hair length. Hair length. Mm. What is the hair length? length? Uh huh. The, uh -huh. Short tan, or long? Largo es el cabello. That's right. Uh huh. La longitud. El cabello. That's right. But in English, okay. Say it in English. Hair length. Hair length. Hair length. All right. Okay, good. Next, what else do body, we describe about people? Body shape. Body, body shape. What is body shape? Uh -huh. La forma. Uh -huh. the, the form. Yeah, the form of the body, the appearance of the body. Correct. And uh, we describe? Face and other parts. Yeah, we describe the face uh, in other parts of the body. Okay, look at the picture. Check just quickly as a reference. This is, uh, talking about hair is the adjective. 
What is the adjective? Long. Long is an adjective. Largo. Next. Mm -hmm. Short. Short. Correct. Okay, you're using adjective. Very good. And we see other pictures as a reference about people's appearance. Okay, thanks. Uh, next, uh, please uh, help me, Jose. Please, uh, what is uh, what else do we need to describe people? Um, describing people, age. Age. If you are, right. you may yeah. might have a pension. So you are an old age pensioner or a senior citizen. An old person might be 65 years old and over. Before you are old, around five, 55, for example, you can be middle age. If you have children, when you are this age, they can be young, adult, 20, 25 years of age or teenage, teenager. Sorry, sorry. Um, no, don't, worry, don't worry. 17 need... to 19 years, I, I, I think. Okay. There are other words for younger children. For example, a toddler is around one to three years old, while a baby is from zero to 12 months old. All right, very good. Okay, basically, when we describe people, we can mention uh, the age, all right? Uh, yeah. For example, in the picture, what is this? It's a baby. A baby? Ah, but you said, ah, da, da, da. there are other words for younger children. For example, a toddler uh, is, um, is someone, okay, is a kid, can be girl or boy, around one, two, or three, three years. years. That is a toddler. But a baby? A baby is? Zero to 12 months. Correct. Old. Uh -huh. Here it is. It's below. Está abajo. Ah, a baby is from zero to 12 months old. That is a baby. But this one is a toddler. Okay. And what about the girl? She's a young adult woman. A young adult. Who is a young adult woman? Uh, what what are the what is the age? The range of the age? 20, 25 and 25 years old. All right, okay. That is that is the range from 20 to 25. Young adult. Uh, the this person? Senior. 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 Elder. Elder. Pensioner. Or pensioner. Hey, teacher, but I don't see the word, uh, uh, the, the old man. Is that correct or incorrect to call a person like him old man? It's uh, correct. Uh, no, it isn't because if you say it in Spanish, it's like uh, el viejo. El viejo, uh -huh. the old man, no, right? That is impolite, mm -hmm. kind of rude. Yes or no? Yes. To say the old the old man. Mm, no. No. Better you say, mejor diga. Senior. The se he is a senior. Or you can say. Elder. Oh, he is, but complete. Subject, very complete. Uh, he is <laughs> elder man. An, oh. an elder man. Correct. He is an elder man. Ahí sí necesita el artículo. And because the word. Um, elder. Teacher. Yeah, uh, okay. we say uh, senior, uh, uh, sir. Like a sir, yes. Uh huh. Correct. Yes. Okay. Like a, sir. Uh, in other words, senior, elder, and pensioner is those are words specific for people who are uh, in this part. Let me see. Uh, uh, what is the H? The H. 65 years or old. Or more. And over. Over. Or más. Jose. Yes. But I can say senior for people 
than have a, a lot of experience. For example, for you, you have a, 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 teach, a senior teacher English, I don't know. Ah, okay. Yeah, you can use it, but in that in that case, you are referring to studies. All right. But yes, you're right. You can ah, he has a, a senior master in graphic design, in nursery, in architecture, etc. But the, that is about the studies. All right, but it's fine. Yes, you can use the word. But in this one, okay. we are describing people's appearance. Okay. Yes, yes. All right, and and this this boy, he is. Mm -hmm. Hello, hello, hello. He is teenager. A teenager. teenager. Ah, he is a teenager. Okay, and these ones are the years, uh, for a teenager. There it is. Thirteen to nineteen years old. Okay. 13. Yeah, 19. thirteen to nineteen. The twenties. Not anymore a teenager. Ya los 20, not a teenager anymore. Uh, please help me. Um, uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, I'm going to select hmm, Guillermo. Next part. What else do we use uh, to describe physical appearance? Mm -hmm. Hello? Hey. All right. Okay, Ana Lucia, maybe. Hi, teacher. Hello. Help me, please, with, with this part. Describing people. Okay. Describing people, physical appearance. Physical appearance. Will body shape. People are built in all shape and size. There are those who are dark and overweight. Mm -hmm. Some people are extreme, extremely, extremely, extremely overweight and are obese. obese. Other people uh -huh. obese. Other people are natural slim, but other look have a short, a solid. Thing. Absolutely, absolutely. absolutely, no fat, no fat or then they are. Thin or skinny. 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 Okay. Other words. Uh, yeah, please continue. Uh, other words for describing people and will are uh, stocky. 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 That means that means uh, in uh, small. appearance, a small. A small but well built. But well built, a uh, pequeño, pero uh, in Spanish uh, we say uh, like, uh, I don't know, well built. Okay. Bien, masicito, right? Well built. Aha, uh -huh. como masicito, but chiquitín, small. Okay. okay, next we use the tall. word normal adjectives tall, tall. short, lean. lean, lean. What is lean? With very little fat. Ah, with no fat. What is what is fat? You know, guys, what is fat? <laughs> ah, no. It's a noun. It's a noun uh, related to to that. Obeso. Ah, uh, no. Obese is obeso is obese. But don't use okay. the word. I will tell you why. Fat is grasa. Fat. Oh. Ah. Uh -huh. With lean, with very little fat, como casi nada de grasa, right? Um, Wiry. Wiry. Quite thin, but muscular. Athletic. athletic. Ah, athletic. someone who goes to the gym, right? People who go to the gym, they are athletic. Next. Okay. Well proportioned. Well proportioned, that means. is generally attractive. attractive. All their body. In all their body. Well proportioned. What is well proportioned? Bien que? Bien proportional. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah. <laughs> all right. Okay. Next. Curvicious. Curvicious. For a woman. In our class. Figure. Figure. Like? Like in 1940. A 
film is that you remember someone who is uh, curvaceous. What is curvaceous? In women. This is in women only. Solo para mujeres, in women. Uh -huh. What is curvaceous? Uh -huh. Curvilinea. Ah, for example, like a 1940s film star. You don't know someone with this description? Uh -huh. From the old movies. From old movies. Okay. Uh, like Marilyn Monroe. Uh -huh. You know her? Uh -huh. Okay, it is referring to this. Next. Fit. Be fit. The gym. <laughs> okay, fit. Means? Healthy. 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 Active. 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 To be fit, you should take plenty of exercise. A lot of exercise. Are you fit, guys? Hey, guys, are you fit? Uh -huh. You consider fit? No. No? <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> I don't <laughs> feel fit in this moment. Okay, yeah. But anyways, todas maneras. Okay. And finally. ¿Cómo se diría? Ya no. Uh, not anymore, not anymore. Uh, like not this. anymore. Okay. Shorter because if not, it turns it turns it off. Okay. Not anymore. Hey, but go to the gym. You need to go to the gym. <laughs> Do exercise. Yeah, it's important. See, we are uh, talking about this. And Flavi, when your muscles go soft. When your muscles go, muscles go soft. What is that? What is flabby? Ideas? Like when you do this and your muscle moves side to side. Oh. No? Yes. Yes? Adivine. Guess, guess, guess. Flabby. Mm -hmm. When you do that. Ah, okay. Okay. You are going to investigate. Okay. Look at the Placido. picture. Ah, correct. Placido. That's right. Guys, don't use this word. Overweight. Overweight. You can use, you can use kind of heavy. Sí. Sobrepeso. Uh, yeah, with overweight. Con sobrepeso. But that is impolite. That's not correct. All right? But you can use heavy. Next, for people like him, you can use... The adjectives? Slim. Slim or? Thin. Thin. Or thin. What is Delgado. slim or thin? Mm -hmm. Delgado. Delgado. Delgadito. Okay. And this one, like him? Skinny. Uh, what is a, a skinny person? Who is a skinny person? Check. Uh -huh. When you can see the bones on someone, in someone. When you see the bones, cuando ve los músculos. Ah, muscles, he doesn't have muscles. <laughs> no, he has no, bones. No, los huesos. Ah, los huesos, but in the adjective, en el adjetivo, en adjective is flaco. Ah, that can be a slim, eso puede ser a slim. This one is kind of huesudo, right? We say huesudo. Yes. Okay, and the normal adjectives. We have short and... Bajo. Uh, yeah, short and... Alto. And tall. Okay, very good. Uh, ne never say someone is overweight or is obese. That is impolite. Don't use the words, all right? Don't use them. Okay, next, uh, please help me. At the ramp. Uh, Erika, Erika, Erika. Next. What else are we use to describe people's appearance? Okay, read, teacher. Yeah, please, read it. Coloring. Uh, you can describe someone as, uh, as an English girl if they have fire hair and um, fire skin. Very white color of, of skin. Someone with this complexion doesn't done easily. Doesn't that does easily easily and has to be careful in the sun. In the sun, you can uh, you can also be blonde 
with a fine complexion. Ah, okay. What is a uh, what is blonde? These people check. Blonde. blonde. The color of hair. Uh, it can be the color of the hair or the skin. All right, both both oh. things. Yes. Or both. we can use both. white. Both. Both. Skin correct. As a skin and hair. A skin and white. hair. Correct. White or. Caucasian. Ah, talking about the appearance. All right. Those two, they are very white. Check. They are chiles. They are gringos. We say. Yes. Yes. Very white. That's why it says English rose or a fair skin, very white in, in the skin color. Continue, please. You are born. You are born with a color white or caucasian. Caucasian, black or Asian. Asian. You can also. You can you can also say person of col color, uh, for example, a woman of color, or a man of color, to describe uh, any anyone who who is not white, but never use the word col color. Color. Ah. People, uh, people was parents uh, out of different ethnic origins origin are, are may, uh, mixed race. Mixing, mixing race. Mixed so, race. Mixed race. So their uh, European, European are sometimes described as Mediterranean. Mediterranean. Thank All you. right. Okay. Mixed race. In Spanish, can you guess uh, what is mixed race? Mixed race. Como mestizaje sería, verdad? Mestizo, correct, yes, correct. But never, never, never use the word colored for to describe someone's appeal. He is colored, no, never use that word. Instead, we use, en lugar usamos a... Man of color. A man of color or better, mejor. African American. He is, a, who is, you remember any actor who is African American? Any actor from movies? Mm -hmm. Who is African American in movies? In Hollywood. Will Smith. Ah, he's he is one, correct. He is an African American, all right? But he is not black. Never use black, neither. Tampoco se usa black. No. Man of color or African American. And people from Asia? Asian. Asian. Correct. We say Asian. In this, in this case, we use those specific words. Okay. Uh, please, uh, Jorge, next. What else we use to describe uh, people? Hello. Yeah. Uh, face. Um, like bile. Faces like. Faces like bile. Uh, build very. Build very a lot. Some people have oval face. Their foreign hair. What is forehead? What is the forehead? This is my forehead. Check. Uh -huh. La frente. Mm -hmm. Are much, are much uh, wider. Wider that their cheese. What is cheese, guys? What is cheese? Uh, I cheese don't know. Cheese are my cheese. Uh, uh -huh. Okay. Other people have. Her chair, chairpel, chairpel, a square, square of round face or round face. Faces. Okay, look at my look at my face. What type of face do I have? A square, oval, or round? My face. Um, okay, my face is oval. Your face is oval, but mine. How do I look? Oval. Uh, oval. Oval, no, I think my face is, uh, I have a round face, me. 
Let's okay. see. And Carmen, look at Carmen's face. A square. No. Kind of oval. Uh -huh. oval. Let's see, Ana Cristina. Ana Cristina, I don't see you in the camera. Hey, I don't see the others. I, I cannot see your faces, guys. Okay, please active your camera. Continue, please. Here's okay. some. And here's some more vocabulary vocabulary for describing feature. feature. Bushy eyebrow. Bushy eyebrows. Bushy eyebrow. Lots of thin hair on your eyebrow. Eyebrows. Okay, eyebrows, uh, for example, this one. Bushy um, eyebrow. What is bushy eyebrows? When someone has bushy eyebrows. Check. Bushy. Uh -huh. Check. Check the eyebrows. Uh -huh. How do we say? Como decimos? When someone has bushy eyebrows. In Spanish, especially, we use that word. Okay. I, I don't you. understand, teacher. Ah, the, the eyebrows. Check. What is the eyebrows? Cejas. Ah, ah, cejas. Ah, cejas, ¿qué? Poblado. Poblado. But that is in the formal word. In the informal word that we use, a Salvadorian use informal word. Sí. Uh-huh. Someone Se knows? Sejudo. Sejudo. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Correct. Yeah. But in English, <laughs> we refer to people with Bushy eyebrows, correct. Bushy eyebrows. Uh -huh. Bushy, poblado, right? Or say who? Okay, but that's kind of funny. Next, people look at her teeth. Crooked. Mm. Crooked. What is she has? Teeth? Uh, uh, uh -huh. What else? Crooked. Ah, uh, here it is. Aquí está. Can you read it? Uh, teeth you need crooked. you need to wear a brace to make them straight to make them straight ah, okay necesito usar qué brackets brackets correct because her teeth are crooked están como tupidos uh, desalineados tupidos uh, etc okay very good next picture ah uh, Nose person. Nose um, person. Look at the form of the nose. Check. Oh. It's kind of irregular. Check. What is that? A uh, nose, crooked uh, nose, hooked nose. Check. Prominent, Prominent nose. nose. But, okay. but not a wise nose. Okay, look at uh, Ronnie's Ronnie's nose. He has mm. a, a, a snoop nose. A snoop nose. What is a snoop nose? A nose which, which goes, goes up outside. Yeah. at the end. Aha. That goes up at the end. Kinda, so. right? Cuando sube, punte aguda, caina. Like that. Okay. And finally, person. Person with dimples. With dimples. With dimples. So what is what is the word dimples? Camanance. Uh -huh. All right. And when, the description. When, when you get little holes in your checks or next to your mouth when you smile. When you smile, okay. When you get little hollows in your cheeks, in your cheeks. Okay, you have dimples, guys? You have dimples? Let me see. A smile, no. a smile. <laughs> uh -huh. No, no dimples. Oh, no. I, I have, I have, I have dimples. Okay, next, uh, please help me. Uh, Next, next, JC, JC, JC. Next, yes. about people's appearance. What else? Ah, ladies, ladies. Uh huh. You. Hair. 
The hair. Okay, look at the picture. The hair. Number one. Long curly hair. Long curly. Curly. curly? Colocho. Huh? Hey, guys, guys, boys, do you like curly girls? Guys, boys. Rizado. Ah, oh, you color. prefer? You prefer rizado. Rizado es? Oh, curly. No, curly es colocho. ¿En rizado? Wavy hair. Ah, como ondulado es, rizado ondulado. Wavy, with wavy hair. Wavy this hair. Is short, straight hair. Short, straight hair. Okay, very good. Corto y liso. Ajá, <laughs> cortito, liso. Bonito. Okay, beautiful. Next. Going bold. Ah, going bold. ¿Qué es esta qué? Going bold. Calvo. Ah, ¿cómo decimos? Aquí el señor se está quedando calvo. In English. <laughs> Ajá. Um, he... He's he, going to bold. Correct. He's going bold. He's going bold. Correct. He's, he's going bold. Easy. Ah, with letter A. He's with letter he's A. Bold. Sorry. Letter A. Bold. Se está quedando calvo. Okay. Va para calvo, right? He's, he's going bold. bold. <laughs> okay. Next. Red head. Red head. What is red head? And the color of the hair. The color of the hair, but in the translation is? Rojizo. Pelo rojo. Pelio, pelo rojo. We don't call them pelo rojo, right? No les decimos, hey, pelo rojo, no. No. <laughs> uh, how do we say? ¿Cómo le decimos? How, did, how would you describe someone with uh, with red hair? Pelo roja. Peli roja, of course, yes. Ajá. No pelo rojo, no. Okay. <laughs> Next. Receding hairline. Someone with a receding hairline is... Receding like hairline. Ajá. Uh -huh. What is this? Can you guess the meaning? Entradas. Ah, entrada, but not about restaurant, right? No, it's not about eating. It's about the appearance someone has on the head. Next. French. French. Or French. Look at the hair style that she has. French. Uh, what is French with a French? Mm. Talking about hair, hair style. Check, 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 check. Mm. This part. What is that in Spanish? Flecos. Uh, no. Mm -mm. It's on the front. You know Selena, right? Selena in the concerts, she used a uh, French when when she when she sang. Uh -huh. No. El Como el fleco. Correct. Correct. Fleco. Mm, no. Yeah. Can be too. Puede ser también. Fleco o cepillo. All right. Okay. Next. It's a... Uh... Shaved head. Shave the head. Shave what the is head. shaved? When the man Rapado. Uh, mm -hmm. no. when uh, the man goes to the barbery and he requests uh -huh. Uh -huh, and the zero, the zero. Um correct. The zero, Rap zero Rapado. Rapado. Okay, very good. And this hairstyle is pony child. Ponytail, ponytail. What is ponytail? ponytail? Cola de caballo. Correct. Very good. Okay, guys, you can read the descriptions. No problem. But check the styles of people's hair. Next, we have more. Is skin on surface, on skin surface. Example number one. This gear has... Freckles. 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 Uh, what is freckles? This is small dots. Uh -huh, los puntitos. Los dots. Pecas. Correct. Freckles. Next. Skin tags. Skin tags. What is skin tag? Lunares. 
Ah, es, mm, es King Tanks. Let me see. Uh, 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 it doesn't appear in this part. Uh, no. But check. Lunar is de? Carne. Ajá. Uh -huh. Those are skin no. tags. Lunar is um, specifically? It's molds. Molds. You have molds on your skin, guys? Do you have molds? A lot? All right. I have molds, too. Molds. What else? This what? one. Spots, Spots, pimples, pimples, pimples. acne, no nas, conocido como no nas, acne, acne, all right, okay, next, word, word, what is a word on someone's Berruga. skin, okay, you have words, do you have any words, let me see, uh, no. get closer to the camera, Get closer to the camera. So if you have some rats. Okay. Next. Wrinkles. Wrinkles. Ah, that that comes from the age. With the age. Viene con la edad. Unfortunately, yes. And what is a wrinkles? Mm -hmm. Arrugas. Correct. Wrinkles. Okay. And this one is... A birthmark. A birthmark. What is a birthmark? You have any? Las marcas de nacimiento. Uh -huh. You have any? No. Any birthmark? No. Erica? Yeah. No. Yes. Maybe. All have a birthmark. We all have. Okay. Mm -hmm. Can be. But it's it. Okay. Very good. Guys. A lot of vocabulary you can check when describing someone's skin, all right? Specifically, someone's skin. Okay, more vocabulary and practice. In these links, you're going to find more adjectives, more nouns, so you can review about people's appearance. But let's do next. Okay, indication is... To describe people's appearance, we use, what do we use when describing Where to be. people? Where to be. Plus? Plus adjectives. Plus adjectives. Examples. She is Emily. Emily is attractive. Uh -huh. Next. Emily is gorgeous. 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 What is Emily. gorgeous? What's gorgeous? I don't know, teacher. It's similar to more beautiful. It's more beautiful. It's more than beautiful. Correct. Ah, bellissimo. Oh. That's right. Gorgeous. Emily? Gorgeous. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. These ones are adjectives. Bear to be. Check. Bear to be. Emily is. Alessandro is, uh, they are, etc. They are attractive, etc. But on the other side, we use to describe people. Bear have. The verb have. Plus noun. Plus, plus, plus noun. Examples. Emily has a long hair. Ah, okay. Emily has, ah, correct. A long uh, hair. That's right. Next. Emily has a black eyes. Uh, in this case, a uh, is not correct because black uh. eyes is plural. Mm. The article, the article, a uh, or an is only for singular, for singular words, right? Oh. But for, for plural, no, you don't need to use the articles. No problem. Emily has Emily a black has eyes. Black eyes. Mm -hmm. Emily Doing has a, a brunette skin color. Correct. Okay. Check. But has because it's the third person, right? What about uh, we have we have hair? All oh, we have hair. Let me see. Uh, Jorge has hair. Yeah. Ana Cristina as well. Carmen as well. Okay. Very good. All right. Easy. This is easy. 
using uh, people's adjectives to describe them or nouns. Let's practice a little bit. Okay. Indication is using adjectives describe the next famous people. Okay. But you can use uh, adjectives and you can use what else you can use? Adjectives. Adjectives and and what else? Verb to be nouns. nouns. And nouns. Know. Yes. Yeah, this is a noun. long hair. Yes or no? That is a noun. It's a noun. Long hair, black eyes, a brunette Burn skin red. color, etc. Bushy, uh, bushy eyebrows, sejuda. Uh -huh. All right. Those are nouns. It's a song noun. And these ones, adjectives. Okay. For this actor, you know him? Who's him? Who's him? Uh, Way Johnson. The Rock. <laughs> and there the rock. He is complete, complete. He's the Rock. He's, He's the Way Rock. Johnson. Okay. Guys, describe, please, Dwayne Johnson's appearance in this picture. Describe him. Remember, he's going to blood. Uh, he's going he's, bald, but he, uh, he's going bold. But this is kind of incorrect. He's not going bold. He is bold already. He mm -hmm. is. He's a strong man. Yes. Yes. Uh, okay, but talking about that, he is bold. No puede decir he is going bold. ¿Por qué no puede decir he is going bold? Because he is, uh, he is, he, he is, he is um, bald already. He has lost the hair yeah. already. Ya, ya perdió el cabello. Así que, you are going to say, va a decir? Lost. He's bald. He's bald. He's bald, correct. Él es? He's Cal strong. Calvo, calvito, yes. All right. What, what else? About He's strong. A strong he, man. Ah, he, yeah, he, correct. He he's, strong. he's a strong. All right, that is correct. He's he a is, uh, he is man of color. Ah, he's a man of color. Correct. That's right. He's a man of color. He what else? He's up uh, there. He stole. He stole. Uh -huh. He stole. Very good. What else? Uh -huh. No more? What about this? He's mm. a stronger man. He's a stronger man. Ahí sería, él es un hombre más fuerte. Mm. Always uh, raise his eyebrow. Ah, mm. in, in the movie. Ah, okay. He ah, but that is yeah can be correct because you are describing what he does. He rises his eyebrow. Eyebrows. His eyebrow. Okay. Yeah, correct. Okay, very good. What I else? Have a I have he, tattoo. He, he seems hungry. Can you repeat it? Repeat it, please. He, he seems hungry. He looks. Ah, in the picture, yes. He looks angry in the picture. Correct, because angry is an adjective. And you are describing uh -huh, what he... Uh, when he shows, lo que muestra, correct. What else? Hey, about the tattoo, can you describe the tattoo? Yes or no? Yes, Only teacher. He is, he is, he is, he is. Uh -huh. He has. Correct. He has. That... Uh, he has, he has a tattoo. 
Y como digo, él tiene un tatuaje bien grande en English. He has a big tattoo. Correct. He has a big tattoo. ¿En qué hombro? In what in which part of his It's body? In, in the left, in the left um, arm. Oh, I, in, correct. Left arm. No, it would be the left. It would be the left, correct. On the left arm or chest. Chest. Ah, part of part of the chest, part of the shoulder, correct. Yeah, shoulder. Let's let's place shoulder. No problem. Okay, very good. Aha. He has ah, muscles. Correct. He has muscles. Tiene músculos. Correct. Y como digo que él es musculoso en English. He is muscle muscle Bound. This is the adjective. Check. Okay. Muscle bound. Uh, you can check in the dictionary to get the definition. There it is. Uh, this is this is the word. Can you read it? You yes, yes, to describe someone who has very large muscle that make it difficult to move normally. All right, very large muscles, muscles. Pronunciation is muscles. In other words, the rock. Okay, very good. Nice, nice, nice guys. Next, the next one is, let me see. Ah, you know her? I guess, I guess, yes. You know the girl? Check. I will make her assume. Oh. Check. Uh -huh. Who is she? She has a... Uh... Uh, but you know her? Do you know her? Yes or no? Yes, teacher. Oh. She's Emma Watson. Who is Emma? Okay. Who is Emma Watson? Correct. Okay. Yes, Carmen. What are you going to say about Emma? Um, She has a dress black. She has a black dress. Yes, okay. Okay, correct. She, All right. she, has, she has a short hair. Ah, she has a short hair. Mm, not totally, I agree. Middle a, hair? Correct, very good, nice. We can say middle, middle long okay. hair, for example. Medio largo, right? Middle long hair. She has middle long hair. Correct. Very good. Okay. What else? What else can you tell me about Emma? Huh? Is she ugly? Is she no, ugly? She's beautiful. No, she's right. beautiful. She's beautiful. Correct. She's beautiful. She she is thin. Ah, correct. In the picture, yes. Or maybe in the real life, she is. She is thin. Delgada. Uh -huh. Thin. She has, she has thin. black hair, Carmen said. Black dress, sorry. Black dress. What else? About the hair, can you repeat the sentence about the hair? No, can you repeat it? Brown eye. Okay, she she has brown eyes, correct? Okay, what about the skin color? She has a blonde, a blonde girl. Uh, okay, she's you can a say she's she's blonde, normal. That's it. She's blonde, Rubia. Uh, blonde, she has blonde skin better. She has blonde skin because she is not, she's not blonde, but rubia. Check. She's not blonde. Okay. Very good. Last thing, last thing about Emma. The last 
adjective or noun about her appearance no more okay she has she has a definite body she has a definite body oh mm -hmm. she has a definite body body eh, cuerpo definido sí. Cuerpo definido, pero vimos ah, el. No sé okay, cómo but... se decía. Se me olvidó. Ah, el, she has el, el adjective. You mean body. about in the body, right? In this part. Yes. Yes. Ah, let me see. A slim. Ah. Slim. A slim boy. Well proportioned or curvaceous. Those two. Eso dos puedo usar. Okay, very good. That's it. All right, guys, thank you uh, very much for participating. The time is over. It's already nine o'clock. Continue describing people who are in, in, this, in this presentation. Check, you have more people to describe. See, this one, this is another actor. Uh -huh. In plural, check. Try describing people in plural as well. Using, uh, the the adjectives and the nouns okay she's thin correct about emma watson okay guys thank you very much see you tomorrow for class number 10 class number 10 thank you guys see thank you you, guys. Good to good see you good night bye bye good night see you guys have a good night Marito.